we are talking about stages of internationalization in the international context and in that we are discussing the topic of global product and area division structures and within that we are particularly concerned about the human resource issues that may be coming up in uh, a global product or area division structure there are two major decisions regarding the type of structure and particularly with uh, the human resource function of a global product area division structure number 1 is the degree to which key decisions are made by the parent company headquarters or they are made at the subsidiary units so whether you want to go for a decentralization approach or you want to go for a centralization approach in centralization approach decisions would be made at the parent country headquarters and in a decentralization uh, decentralization approach decisions would be made on the uh, uh, subsidiary level it's not necessary that uh, every organization will have the same level of if you say that it is a decentralized organization it will have the same type of decentralization it is going to vary according to the company requirements and uh, how much you can go for decentralization or centralization it is dependent on a number of factors it depends on the type of industry in which you are operating if your industry is changing rapidly uh, innovative challenges are there then you will have to go for a decentralized approach whereas if your product is not changing much for example you can take the example of coca cola that product is the same for many many years and there is not much innovation in the product the of, of obviously they are offering a number of variations but uh, the innovation or the speed of technological changes is not as fast as there is in the computer industry or there is in the mobile phone industry so it is a relatively slow uh, industry as far as technological or innovative changes are concerned so in that kind of a situation you can have a more centralized structure a decision making uh, process which is taken uh, which is taking place at the headquarter level now the other uh, structural decision that has to be taken is what type of control is exerted by the headquarters on the subsidiary units is it authoritative strict type of control or is it a kind of uh, Uh, lenient control system in which the participation of uh, the subsidiary unit is also taken into account so the type of control which is exerted by the headquarters on the subsidiary unit that is also a decision which needs to be taken hrm concerns which are related to the global product area division structure are to facilitate decentralization of all human resource management activities particularly uh, with reference to human resource management you cannot have an extremely centralized approach because you have to manage human resources the uh, human resources at the ground level in the country in which you are operating you have to manage with their culture you have to manage with their workforce so you need to facilitate the decentralization the corporate headquarters of hr they need to facilitate the decentralization of the human resource management activities uh they have to strive to adapt human resource activities with each country's requirements so you need to take into account all the requirements of staffing planning recruitment selection uh, performance management and all the function of human resources and you have to adapt those functions with the uh, with the requirements of the local market 
so uh, the corporate headquarters has to make sure that the human resource function of your foreign subsidiary is adapted with the local market the corporate uh, headquarters um, uh, performs the monitoring role of setting strategic direction so the corporate uh, department of hr at the headquarters level unka ye kaam hai ki wo aapki overall strategic direction jo hai wo set kare ki aapne basically aapke human resources management ki kya ek overall strategy hai aapne performance ko Uh, जो है वो मैनेज uh, करना है या आपने लोगों को uh, ज़्यादा आपने उनको कॉम्पनसेशन के ऊपर फोकस uh, करना है या आपने उनकी ट्रेनिंग एंड डेवलपमेंट के ऊपर फोकस करना है आपके बेसिक कैरियर स्ट्रक्चर्स क्या हैं ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के अंदर आपने एक कैरियर फ्रॉम स्टार्ट टू एंड प्रोवाइड करना है या आपने ज़्यादा मोबाइल कैरियर्स प्रोवाइड करने सो ऑल दीज आर कॉपरेट स्ट्रैटीज which have to be communicated and then the corporate hr department it uh, monitors that those strategic decisions are being implemented at the subsidiary level or not and then uh, one of the hr issue concerned with the global product area division structures is that you need to have more staff that is required for coordination activities between the headquarters and the division which is operating uh, somewhere else in the uh, in the world so these are the human resource management concerns which are important for managing the human resources in a global product area division structure 